States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. What class you wearing right now? Broadcast speech. So what is this? Shoreline Broadcast News. Good morning, Motor Shores. These are your daily announcements for Tuesday, March 7, 2023. I'm Kelsey Joe Benedict. And I'm Diana Ajene Devet Fest. NHS is hosting a book drive for March's reading month. All books collected will be donated to Embrace Books in downtown Muskegon. Embrace Books provides books free of charge to everyone. Last year they gave away 70,000 books to people in Michigan organizations, and teachers. You can drop off books in the main lobby until Friday. Motor Shores Comic Con is Saturday, March 25th from 9 to 1. All ages are welcome. Prizes, artists, authors, Jedi consoles, esports, free button making, face painting, cosplay contest, and more await for you at this free event. Guest band, the Sissy Boys, will perform also. Bring cash because we have plenty of vendors who will sell unique collectibles and merch. The Interact Club is hosting a drive for every woman's place until Friday. We ask that you donate feminine products, cleaning supplies, paper plates or bowls, sanitizers, body washes, shampoos, and more. Donations can be dropped off in Mr. Brown's room. Help make a difference. Come out to Chamber Music Night tomorrow. It will be filled with classical music by ensemble and soloists in our performing arts department. This event is in the auditorium at 7 p.m. Art Club meeting this Thursday from 3 to 4 in room 205. Cookies, fun, and community. Bring a friend. Students, if you have not done so already and wish to nominate some classmates to be members of the Hope Squad, please do so by the end of today. Nominated students should exhibit the following character skills. Kindness, easy to talk to, good listener, and genuinely care for about others. The Google form for nominating was emailed to you yesterday at 9 a.m. Congratulations to the following students who have been nominated to represent Mona Shores High School at the West Michigan Student Showcase. Academics, Gavin Stout. Athletics, Delaney Buckner and Jackson Huffman. Digital Media Arts, Jacob Schnotala and Noah Fritzmeyer. Literary Arts, Maddox Shaner Follett. Performing Arts, Solo Act with Accompanist, Sophia Anderson and DeKayla Bell. Performing Arts Group, Bree Tish, Ali Threadgill, Leah Baldwin, Wes Bell, Jack McCann, John Gates, DJ Craven, Shane Tudor, James Norwood Kyers, Noah Boyden, Isaac Model, Colin Patterson, Noah Carr, Colin Thompson, and Mick Wolfhard. And for Visual Arts, Joel Klimek. I'm here with Katie's brother who got shouted out for being nice and funny. Today for March's Reading Month, we have J.K. Rowling, British author and creator of the popular and critically acclaimed Harry Potter series. J.K. Rowling's writing is whimsical and rhythmic with lots of irony and good flow. Her humor is dry and witty, her writing is very subjective and personal, and most of the sentence structure feels quite casual. Today's word of the day is wanderwort, a loan word borrowed from one language and established in many unrelated languages usually in a chain determined by established trade routes and sometimes undergoing changes through contact with the dominant language where the word is adopted. This is Sailor Country. We do everything with pride. JV and Varsity softball trials are March 13th at 3 o'clock in the Hannishan Gym. If you're looking for a fun time with friends, this is a great opportunity. You must have a physical on file with the athletic office to participate. Girls soccer tryouts are March 13th through 15th. Trials will take place at the soccer complex from 4 to 6 p.m. Please make sure you have a physical on file in order to try out. We will also have strength and conditioning every day this week from 5.45 to 7 p.m. with our annual four-mile run on Friday at 4 p.m. starting at the soccer field. For everyone trying out for baseball this season, there will be a brief informational meeting today at 3 o'clock in Coach Kent's classroom. The boys and girls track teams are conditioning this week from 3 to 5. We will meet in the Sailor Center lobby. Boys basketball played a great first half but fell to Union 63-75. Leading the Sailors were Jordan Bledsoe, J.T. Foster, and Ryan Opsommer. The Sailors, we would like to thank the parents, fans, and everyone else involved to make this season possible. Today in sports, League of Legends plays Anchor Bay in Ogama Heights, and Splatoon plays Forest Park. 
Today's weather is a high of 49 and a low of 31. That's all we have for you today, sailors. Have a Taco Tuesday. But you've got